What's going on, y'all? It's Claude. You're checking me out again at Mostly Healthy Food Reviews. <laughs> I got one question before we get started. Did you miss me? Did you miss me? <laughs> I'm back. I'm back at it like I never left. I'm back at it like a craftmatic. I am today. I'm excited. Why? I'm in Danbury, Connecticut with this one, guys. I decided to swing over to the mall, and I'm going to swing in real quick to go to a place that I've never been to before, but has been in my hopes and dreams that I would finally get a chance to come across this location in my travels, doing food reviews for you guys, mostly healthy. But this one today, there's no health at all to this video. So for anybody who is not really looking into not eating healthy every once in a while, this video may not be for you, but sit back, get ready. I'm heading over to 203 Exotic Snacks, Danbury, Connecticut, located in the Danbury Fair Mall. And as usual, I'm going to drop the address in the bottom of this video. <sighs> Enough talking. Let's get in there and see what they got for me today.
203 Exotics. Big shout out to Mike and his girlfriend who were very, very welcoming to me when I came in. I told him what I was doing as far as me recording. And he basically just gave me the, the floor. He said, do what you got to do. Let me know what you want to try. And I purchased some things. Oh, I'm flabbergasted. That's the word I'm going to use today, guys. Flabbergasted. Here's why. Popcorn has always been one of my favorite snacks. I like it buttery. I like it a little salted. Not a lot, but a little salted. I like it buttery. It's a snack, right? It's a go-to snack. Now, keep in mind, I don't do these snacks all the time. I do them on occasion. And that's what this is, moderation. But every once in a while, you want to have fun. Maybe revisit your childhood like I'm about to talk about. And honestly, just enjoy yourself. Enjoy life. Stop being so mad all the time. Smile. Love the experience. I love this store. I would definitely be back. But I got to talk about some things. First things first. Smart Food is one of my favorite popcorns, hands down. I've loved Smart Food forever, probably since my childhood. Love, love, love Smart Food. But here's the thing. <laughs> they added Doritos to it. Oh my goodness. My, one of my favorite chips also. So besides the Smart Food popcorn, they put Doritos together and they just basically banged them out and meshed them. Uh, oh my goodness. Those flavors were dancing off the tip of my tongue. So basically the popcorn, when I looked in the bag, there were no broken kernels or anything. Very, very big pieces of popcorn flavored with the Doritos powdered flavor on top of them. And they were drenched in this Dorito flavor. Soon as you open the bag, matter of fact, when I held the bag up to my face, I actually smelled the Doritos through the bag. Oh, this was good stuff. Oh, I'm in love. I'm in love with popcorn and smart food Doritos. I'll give them a score in a minute. As a matter of fact, no, I won't. Let's just do it right now. I'm going with a 10. I'm going with a 10 on the smart food flavored Doritos brand. Oh, this was good stuff. If you guys love popcorn like I do, <laughs> this is what you need in your life. At the end of the video, stay tuned because I'm actually going to give you Mike's website, his link. So that if you ever want to order any of these snacks that you see in this video before you try to come down to the store or if you can't make it to the store, if you live out of the area and you can't make it down to the store, you actually have the ability, according to Mike, to place an order for any of these products you see and he'll basically ship them to you. You can talk to him about the details. The other one I want to talk about though, if anybody really knows me, family, friends, schoolmates, Back in school, high school especially, I used to walk around, this is no lie, with packs of Reese's peanut butter cups in my pocket that I would enjoy one a day on my lunch break during recess or, or whatever. Oh, Reese's, they're the perfect candy in my opinion. You got peanut butter, you got chocolate. It, mm. Do you know what I would do if I took a pack of Reese's and I would put them in the freezer and they got frozen, frozen Reese's peanut butter cups? Let's just say they're not pretty by the time I get to that package. I tear them up all the time. 10 out of 10 times, that's what it is. Y'all decided to make me sit there and get giddy. <laughs> Reese's popcorn. Y'all see this bag? Look inside the bag for a minute. What do you see? Big behind kernels of popcorn. And they're drenched with peanut butter and chocolate drizzle on top of them in my mind this is food porn guys this is food porn this is something that i wasn't ready for today on this video but honestly when i saw that bag i just had hearts in my eyes and as you see while i was eating it just now it brought a tear to my eye <laughs> keep in mind i can't eat this stuff all the time i wouldn't want to eat this stuff all the time because it would actually take away from my experience with either the smart food doritos popcorn or of course the reese's popcorn <laughs> here's my score on the reese's popcorn i really have to guess as to what i'm going to give it as far as the score i'm being silly today with a 20.
my first 20 on any kind of food, snack, beverage ever. This was everything to me. Oh my God, it was everything. Ah! Whoever put this together, the Reese's popcorn, thank you. Honestly, mind blown. I'm sure it's been out for a while. This is my first time having it. So bear with me, y'all, while I basically feel total elation from this popcorn. 203 Exotics, Mike, thank you for your hospitality. Thank you for having a store like this in the general area in Connecticut. Now there's a couple other locations from I found out. There's a few in New York as well. So if you guys actually have a store like this in your area, give them a try, check them out, get down, support small business. This is incredible. Oh my goodness. Hold on a second, cue the music back. I gotta, I gotta sell away some more. Ladies and gentlemen, if you like the videos, do me a favor, click subscribe, turn notifications on. That way you get my level of madness. Mondays, Fridays, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard. That's right, I said 6 p.m. Eastern Standard is the new time for my videos. And once again, this is Claude at Mostly Healthy Food Reviews. YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, Newsbreak. I'm on all social media platforms. If there's a health bonus in my food, it's an added bonus. Like I said in the beginning of the video, and this is my actual disclaimer, I didn't say anything in this particular video today was healthy, but that's why the channel is called Mostly Healthy. I'm joking, guys. <sighs> but I got to get off my chest. I love this job sometimes. I just, mmm. Now I'm gonna call my sister Brooke because she's also a big Reese's peanut butter cup head. So I wanna show her and maybe bring her the bag of popcorn today to kind of surprise her. I'm such a good brother, I swear. In either case, y'all be cool on the other side of the pillow. Let me take off, I'll talk to y'all next time.